Hello there ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode here on Past Years, it's an absolute pleasure to have you, thank you very much for joining us. Today we're doing another episode of Anime Like, anime that I like, that you may like. And today's episode is actually going to be about Yawamushi Pedal, New Generation Slash Glory Line, which is uh, the name of the most recent series of this. Uh, Yawamushi Pedal is, uh, I, I, I can't even start it because I'm, I'm mm, so excited to talk about this yeah, show that I actually, I'm going to break the rules of what I was about to do. The rules of this episode, the rules of the show, is that I have only got the time of the opening sequence of the show to explain to you why you should check the show out. Uh, with a name like Yawamushi Pedal, New Generation, and Glory Line, it doesn't really give you an explanation of what the show is about, so I haven't spoiled anything by saying the title, but, but, <laughs> we'll actually check out the sea. Let's see what we've got in here. Ba -ba -bum, ba -bum. Everything's set up and ready to rock and roll. So in three... Two, one. Yomushi Pedal is a cycling anime based on the basic premise of pretty boys do awesome things. If you like Hayaku, if you like Free, I would totally Swim Club. If you like uh, Idolish, I don't know, there's a bunch of other shows that are very similar. It's a bunch of pretty boys, mad boys, interesting boys, and excitable boys riding bicycles up mountains, down mountains, and all over mountains. And it's actually very entertaining to watch. I'm not, I, I was a cyclist, I'm not a massive, like, I'm not a competitive cyclist or anything, but I actually enjoy it and I get a massive thrill out of actually watching these races and watching how intense these guys get about their mountain racing on the most calmest, most beautiful ways. I mean, cycling is actually one of those sports that is intense, but it's such a calming intensity, especially with these country roads, and such a beautiful impression of the Japanese countryside as it's shown as it goes through these roads. It is so worth checking out. Um, now, the new generations where I came into the show, I've actually tried to work my way backwards to try and catch up with it. Storyline is the most recent series, about seven episodes in, as they're actually in the middle of a uh, high school tournament. They're actually like pretty much in the middle of the competition, where halfway through, at uh, like, the end of the last season, they were halfway through the tournament, halfway through a major race, and this is just picking up and paying off where they left off. Um, I highly recommend going back and maybe watching again the new generation because there is a generational difference. There was a group of racers in the Ramamushi Pedal. Now the new group are actually essentially the young ones up now as the high schoolers. And the whole point is they're bringing the new generation up with them. So a good place to start would be the beginning of new generation if you can't go all the way back and watch the beginning of Ramamushi Pedal as it started off. This is the main protagonist of the story. A young boy who actually like comes to the school cycling with his, uh, up the school while singing songs. And he is the one to focus on as you watch through the show, especially if you start at the very beginning. Uh, <laughs> That was, that was super difficult to do. Um, I literally tried to explain. I, I didn't want to get into the excitement of the sport or too much of detail about who's who, but I literally at least I got to point out who the main character was by the time I was finished rambling on about that. Uh, Yamushi Pedal is a great show. I highly entertained by it. I actually own a Yamushi Pedal t-shirt. Um, uh, if you ever see me in a yellow and white t-shirt, that's actually the Yamushi Pedal t-shirt that I actually occasionally wear here on stream. Um, yeah, go and check it out. It's a great show. It's super entertaining. It has a bit of charm and unique character to it. Unlike some of the pretty boys do amazing things kind of shows, the um, where a lot of the opposing teams that they're playing against or fighting against or racing against uh, tend to actually have the most charismatic characters. There's some very charismatic and entertaining characters even among their own team. Um, I personally enjoyed this show for that. But the uh, the show itself kind of has a lot uh, a lot to introduce, a lot to show, especially whenever there's actually three seasons of it already. And if you want to go all the way back to the intro, the first season, do so. It's well worth it for a show that's actually been running for not uh, not for a really long time, but for a long enough time that you have a back catalog to go through. But if you don't want to do that, you can easily start with the most recent set, most recent season and the most last two seasons, Glory uh, Glory Line, Glory Road, Glory Line and New Generation are both available on Crunchyroll to check out now. So if you actually enjoyed my description of the show, you enjoy the way I actually do the show, then feel free to actually throw likes, comments, and all the things you actually liked about it. Also, if you think I am completely missing the point of a show, or there was something that I really should have explained that I didn't do so, then I'll, of course, make sure to throw that in the comments underneath as well. Um, if you enjoy the show, thank you very much. Hopefully you actually enjoyed it. Uh, there's a couple of links underneath the video. Some of them actually talk about Crunchyroll, links where you can actually sign up, and I would get um, a throwback for doing so. Don't know if those links are still active anymore because it's been a while since I've used them, but feel free to do so if you actually end up going to Crunchyroll specifically to catch one of these that I've actually put on. But of course, you can watch them for free as long as you're willing to watch out. Um, what else do I need to think about? Oh yes, if you haven't been watching this on YouTube, on Past Seasons Skin on YouTube, feel free to actually 
hit the link above that actually will be appearing over the top of my head, which will be a box of all the other anime likes that I've actually done previously. Over there in the far side will be the most recent video I've done here on the channel. Uh, it may not be related to anime, it may be related to something completely different, so check that one out. And right here will be a video just for you, based on the YouTube analytics and the things you do on YouTube. It will pick a video of something I have made and that you will enjoy. Puts it right there, making it really easy for you to pick it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, if you haven't already watched this on YouTube, again, like, comment, subscribe. If you do not watch it on YouTube, then there will be a surrogate for the subscribe button. They'll be floating around somewhere over here on your version of the page. So, I highly recommend you click on that as well. And yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. I will see all you dudes in the next episode. Bye.